Jim, five points at Stadium MK, first one of the season, job done. Yeah, job done uh, for this week. Um, good start, um, good try and, and sort of a couple of penalties, but then we sort of um, let them back in the game a little bit, it was disappointing. So, um, had a good chat at half time. I think we came out in the second half, played a lot better, played some real tempo, some good go forward, used the ball a lot better, used, used space and um, good to score those tries. People will look at the tries in the second half, but how important was the penalty just before half time after Newcastle had scored those three to make it a, a seven point ball game at half time? Yeah, that, that's important. I think uh, it was good. You know, Stephen's a very reliable goal kicker, and uh, I think it was the right option to take the points there. Um, and then go into the second half. But I think we made some good decisions. We could have taken some more points in the second half, but decided to go for the corner, put them under pressure two or three times. That's where they went down to 14 men, and, uh, and, and we started scoring some, some points after that. George PC came off, um, JJ Hanrahan comes on, goes into the centres, and you know he seemed to just slot in straight away. Yeah, he's a nice player, and um, he, he, we've been training in, in, in that position for quite a lot of the time this week as well. So it, it was nothing new, it was no surprise. And uh, JJ's a lovely player. We know that. We've seen him, you know, playing previously, and uh, he can play play well at 10, 12, or 15. So it, it, it's really, really good options to have. You've mentioned the uh, the period when Newcastle went down to 14 men. You know, people go on about statistics of points scored during Simbin periods. You came away with 12 points to nil in that period very crucial. Yeah, crucial really and I think that's just about game over when you can do that and um, we, we needed to do it, um, we need to keep the pressure on and I think you know we worked hard in the first half without getting too many rewards but then we got it in the second I think all the subs who came um, off the bench really, really contributed um, some of the new lads in particular, you know Jamie Gibson had a fantastic game, Paul Hill carrying, was outstanding in, in the loose play, so really really pleased for them and um, pleased for us You know, hopefully we can improve and, and go forward it already looks like it's going to be an extremely competitive Aviva Premiership season. Um, so to get that home advantage and to make the most of, of playing at home is obviously very important. So to come away from Milton Keynes to go back to Franklin's Gardens with that bonus point win, you know, must be very pleasing as well. Yeah, good question. Um, it, it, it was. We were disappointed last week. It could clearly, you know, we went away to Worcester and uh, we didn't play well. And uh, to come away with just one point, we, 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 we were really disappointed with ourselves but we've done what we've had to do and, and that's why we had a good week this week we've regrouped we've managed to get a bonus point so we're sort of back on track um, but now we need to back that up you know it's one win we've still got loads to work on we, we know uh, we weren't perfect at all so we've got a lot of things to work on it is still early days in the season but hopefully we can do that and um, get a good win up at sale next week